Ladies and gentlemen, we got this news when we got the big update actually, but if you haven't heard, the new banner coming to the game is the Tag Universe Rep Banner, which as you can see has the return of L of Android 17, and then what we can tell from the picture, the image at least, is also Evolutions on there and UI Sign, which this man got a Zenkai, and a lot of people are thinking this guy is going to get a Zenkai, and I think this banner really helps out and seeing that that probably is going to become true that ui sign will be getting a zenkai during anniversary but the bigger thing to take away from this is the fact that this universe rep banner basically signals that the anniversary is going to start with the universe rep character i think that is pretty obvious now if they decide to do two banners at once which a lot of people have been asking for and love it's a great format then maybe we'll get something else alongside it but i think that this banner is basically telling us that we're going to be getting the new uh, you know, Goku and Frieza tag unit, or a tag, you know, Super Saiyan Blue Cow Ken Goku and Super Saiyan Blue Evolution Vegeta, which either one of those would be hype. I would be fine with either one of those. And one thing that I think could be cool and really make this an anniversary unit over perhaps this, because I think more people would probably want this just because it's Goku and Vegeta. But I think that this would be better because then it gives Frieza, this would probably have something, you know, could help with Lineage of Evil. And that would just be a cool thing to have a Goku and a Frieza, a Saiyan and a, you know, Lineage of Evil character would be a lot better than just, you know, another Goku and Vegeta tag unit. We have a whole bunch of Goku and Vegetas. And also, if they made this unit transforming, where, you know, it starts out as base Goku and Frieza, and then they transform, or, you know, they get some sort of time transformation, a short little transformation for, like, some extra damage or something, I think that could be really cool. The first transforming tag unit would be sick. But if you plan on summoning this banner because you are a universal rep main and maybe you didn't get 17 or you want more copies of 17 or you like androids or something, I would tell you to wait to summon on this banner. Do not summon right away because this banner will be around during the anniversary and we have less than a week till anniversary. We literally have six days because today is Sunday the 21st. I'm recording this. We just have... Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday at night, we have the reveals and stuff. They have the stream, which I will be live for. I haven't decided if it'll be, I think it'll probably be over on my Twitch. Maybe I'll do it on YouTube. I'll let you guys know as we get closer. Maybe I'll put up a poll. But we have it on the 26th that we are going to be getting new reveals and stuff. And so the 27th is anniversary. Right then, we have less than a week till 5th anniversary kicks off, commences. And I think it's likely that we're going to be seeing either this or this to begin with. Goku and Vegeta or Goku and Frieza. Then adding in further proof, I suppose, if you want more than just the banner we're going to be getting, Dragon Ball Legends has been posting these, you know, clips where they have a voice actor from Dragon Ball, you know, promoting the anniversary, saying, oh, here we go. This one is Piccolo's voice actor. This was the first one we got on the 19th. And then on the 20th, 14 hours ago, we got this one, which is the voice actor for Tien, which... People have been seeing these and instantly saying, okay, Piccolo and Tien, both are in the Tournament of Power, leaning towards, you know, Universe Survival Saga, Universe Rep, as we saw with the banner that'll be coming out with Android 17, which again, even if you want the Android 17, wait until you see what the anniversary banners are, because that banner will still be there, so just, just wait. But if they drop another one tonight, and it is, you know, like Android 18, or Android 17, or Roshi, I think that that is incredibly likely. Now, you could go with the idea if they drop, like, Roshi or something, that maybe it's Z Fighters or something along those lines. But let's be honest. Super Warriors, I mean. But let's be honest. We're not getting Super Warriors for anniversary. It's not happening. They're not <laughs> They're not cool enough. No offense to Super Warrior fans out there, but it's not happening. Uh, for anything else, in terms of, like, other stuff we got from Data Mines, uh, I believe... This has, some people have discussed this already. I guess we're getting some sort of kind of like, I think it's a roulette type deal. If I hit translate here. Um, yeah, it seems to be a roulette in which you will obtain items since the voice is set in code from when we're doing it from Bulma. Yeah, so it seems we're getting some kind of a roulette. So we're going to probably spin some sort of wheel or something in the game during anniversary. And these are like the text, the assets for it. So we're going to be spinning some sort of wheel getting some sort of rewards from that wheel. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to guess CC is going to be the like best reward, most likely. 
I doubt they'll do something better than CC. They don't normally. They tend to put CC at the top of their list. So I'm assuming CC, but I don't know. We'll find out what the rewards are. We don't know that quite yet. And then, um, yes, so this is telling you what times this banner is here for. It goes until June 17th, and it starts uh, tonight at tonight's weekly re your daily reset. Whatever time the game daily resets for you, it'll be starting. And it ends on the 17th. So again, as I said, wait, wait, wait. Do not go and summon until after the anniversary units come out because you're going to probably want your CC for anniversary units. Let's just let's just be honest here. I would also say don't summon on this Legends Limited banner if you haven't already and you're thinking about it. Wait. Keep waiting. Again, you don't want to summon on this. You end up getting Beerus and then you're like, oh, I have no CC to summon on anniversary for. I cried and get the units. Um, but I think that's really it, besides, like, in terms of important stuff that hasn't been covered and that we got data mined during the last big update. So let me know your thoughts. Who do you think we're getting? Do you think it's going to be Goku and Frieza? Maybe transforming tag Goku and Frieza, first transforming tag? Or do you think it's going to be tag Goku and Vegeta? I suppose it could be, like, an LF God Destruction Toppo or LF Kefla, but I doubt it. I just think it's going to be, I think these two are the ones that you go for for Anniversary. Tapo or Kefla, something you save for when they do like the universe rep things like download celebrations, things like that. That's what I I feel. I think Goku and Freeze is more likely than Goku and Vegeta, but Goku and Vegeta are Goku and Vegeta, and like every tag unit is Goku and Vegeta. So I wouldn't be amazed if that's what ends up happening. But that's going to do it for me. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. Let me know what you're most excited for in an anniversary. Are you going to summon if it is Goku and Vegeta or Goku and Frieza? Let me know in the comments down below. I hope you all are staying happy and healthy, though, having the best of days, and I will catch you all tomorrow.